Well, meanwhile, in normal, the Redbirds, they keep on rolling. They beat Bradley last night 64-50. to You might have missed it because the game didn't start until after I was in bed personally. 9 o'clock. Illinois State is building quite the resume. They're 21-5 overall, 13-1 in the conference. That is good enough to make the tournament, right? Well, Joe Lernardi, ESPN bracketologist, thinks they still have a little work to do. He has ISU as one of the next four out. But head coach Dan Muller says his guys are well aware of the projections. We're not going to pretend they don't look at it, so we talk about it here and there. Any coach is going to tell you if one day at a time, focus on the process. And that's, that's true. That's not just coach speak. But we also want to use it for motivation. Um, we want to play in the tournament. We know that. We know there's one way to get in for sure. Is there a second way to get in this year? I don't know. I've discussed it with Paris, Mikhail, Tony, Deontay multiple times this year, and, and they're certainly driven by it. 13-1 in the NBC. They're having a special season. They might have the best shot at breaking the state's four-year tournament drought. Northwestern will be in the mix, but it doesn't look like Illinois will. Penn State, one of the youngest teams in the conference, they delivered the final nail in the coffin yesterday as far as the Illinois tournament hopes go. And this game followed a familiar script. They fell way behind, rally back, and then run out of gas what they're capable of and we got to do that more consistent but you're right like you're in you're in February and especially with older guys and again I'm not trying to pick on I love our older guys but I do expect a little bit more from them you know um, in terms of that consistency in some of those intangible areas and uh, they had it on Tuesday it was a big reason why we won you know and today they had it for parts Senior day at Huff Hall over in Champaign. 10th ranked Illini wrestling team hosting Indiana. That is Zane Richards, the senior, going out with a bang. And poor Garrett Peppel, he just had no shot today. He wins by tech fall in his final home match. Watch this, special moment, kisses the mat. That's special, he'll always remember that one. Carbondale kid, he goes out with a bang. Fellow senior Zach Brunson, two point takedown. He gets a standing ovation from the Illini faithful. He wins at seven to four. And the main event of the evening, Isaiah Martinez. What else is new? He's still undefeated. He wins 24 to seven. Illini take the entire match. It's just another day at the office for Imart. 90 and one in his career. Illinois 24 to seven, they take it. The play of the day on WAND is brought to you by Menards. Lincoln is one of those teams that can just beat anyone when they're on their A game. And sure, they were on their A game Friday night. Bryson Kirby, look at this. Wow. Kid has unlimited range. As soon as he walks into the gym, he can shoot it. Seven of seven from downtown. Lincoln takes down numero uno Lanfear in the state. The students rush the court. Great moment there. I love whenever kids rush the court. Shows their passion. They really love it. Lincoln wins. Congrats off to Lincoln. Stick around, Kevin Sherrick, have another look at weather.